sense. Oh, and Mr. Marconi and Faro to move up the previous to Stony Bay beat Pratara's Bay and a desert chill in third spot. Now Faro, winner of this year's Doncaster handicap moves in Mr. Marconi. The New Zealander coming forward. The reserves not required here Chunganoff and Brahuego. And they're all set for the Group 1 Epsom handicap 1600 metres. Starter Bill Cooper coming along towards his stand. Climb same. They'll be off at any moment. Racing in the Epsom. Oh, Taradu missed it by three lengths. And Rambetica missed it by ten. By gosh, there's a sensation. Hedge goes to the early lead. Sprint Byers tackling Hedge and going up very, very quickly as they settle into stride. Final tempo. And Cohort's not that far away. And around the outside up looking for the leaders. Dane win. Dane win. Jackie Che takes it to the leader. Length and a half on Nick's Joy. Followed third final tempo. Cohort sprint by Hedge. A length further back, my Diamond Rouge Vital Consent. And Danarani sees gay. Little over a length further back in the field on the inside is Auntie Mary. Salivate got tightened up a fraction there and then Star Dancer as they come down the side of the track. Length and a half then to Jameer, Mr. Marconi, followed by Juggler. Good margin off then to Turadu, Persian Flyer. And last of all is Rambetica. 700 to go. Dane win from final tempo. Next Joy. A length of the stable mates, Hedge and Cohort, followed by My Diamond Rouge, sprint by then Vital Consent. Danarani sees gay and Auntie Mary. Mary. One further back is Pharaoh Star Dancer, Mr. Marconi. Good margin off next is Juggler as they race to the corner from Jamia Salivate. Taradu is a mile back and then Persian Flyer and Rembetica straightening up in the Epsom on top of the rise and Nick's Joy on the outside joins Dane Wynn. Third is Sprint by Vital Consent is wide out. A gap to Hedge and then My Diamond is Star Dancer and Juggler. Nick's Joy just leads Dane Wynn. Sprint by struggling followed by Vital Consent but it's Nick's Joy the leader. Nick's Joy Joy, in fact, is coming away from Dane Wynn, and Nick's Joy wins the Epsom. Dane wins second, Juggler third from Star Dancer, Seascape, Danarani, Vital Consent. Then sprint by an Auntie Mary, My Diamond Rouge, Taradu. Further back was Hedge, and then Pharaoh followed home by Persian Flyer. Then Salivate from Jamia, Good Margin, Final Tempo, Rembetica, and Cohort near enough to the tail of the field. Protest Adelaide. 16, Nick's Joy on the Super Tab, 1960 and 620. Number two, Dane Wynn to return 310. And number 12 for third, Juggler to return $3.60. Back to Ian in just a moment. Last at the Greyhounds, Kel O'Rourke. Then the Canberra Sand and Gravel Stake ready and racing. Frisky's boy slow to go, getting out Frogmore Ferrari with Mid-City and Black Piston driving up with Dear Miss the inside. Frogmore Ferrari and Dig Mit, Dear Miss. Frisky's boys in bother now back towards the tail, getting through Haiti Jakes from Roxby Rev. On settling Frogmore. Frogmore Ferrari, two and a half to Roxby Rev, chasing hard out wider was Haiti Jakes. Then comes Dear Miss Frisky's boy, well back with Black Piston and Mid City and turning for home. Frogmore Ferrari in front, here's Roxby Rev. Frogmore Ferrari in front, Roxby Rev cutting her back. Frogmore Ferrari flopped over the line and a Frogmore Ferrari beat Roxby Rev in the last. Dear Miss third, then Haiti Jakes, Black Piston and Mid City Anne. Off and Kel shortly. Written by Chris Munts, he's really making a. a a real force in the Sydney riding ranks and Nick's Joy has been able to win 16-2-12 Dane win well Jackie J they thought he'd go forward on it did he what and under the circumstances 57 and a half it's been an outstanding gallop to get second and Juggler has raced home well into third place the official fourth for the pick four elsewhere Star Dancer Star Dancer number three fourth and number 20 ran fifth and that was vital consent the time was 134.91, 134.91, record 133.8 held by Raffendale. A sensation at the start. Taradu was slowly away, but Rembetica stood absolutely flat-footed and was lucky to come out of the stalls. Missed it about eight lengths. The sectional breakdown, 600 metres in 35.41, 35.41. The first 800 took 47.62. And the winner next joy by Luskin Star from Snapshot, a four-year-old chestnut gelding, raced by Mr. N. Sipka, trained by J.A. Short at Warwick Farm, and uh, certainly Mr. Short's biggest win, and Chris Munts, the winning rider. Two second, Dane win an outstanding performance. Dane Hill, Kota Healy, House Bay Horse 4, Bob Thompson for owner Sonny Yamad, Alex Chung, rider Jackie Che, a number 12 juggler by Jugar from Cash Allen, Bay Gelding 4, Gay Waterhouse 4, P.D. and Mrs. S. Horwitz, Ms. V. Bridger, M. Turnbull and R. M. Zeman, ridden by Janie Innes.
a length and a half three quarters with the margins a length and a half by three quarters 134.91 Quinella 109.40 trifecta 1866.30 and the exacta paid 215 dollars and 90 cents more Sydney in a moment Time to update in 5.20, 14, 3 to 17, scratch, 3.62 selections, the last race 8, Brisbane at 5.10, set, Sydney. Line looks pretty steady. A, well, the away at any tick of the clock here at Royal Randwick. Movement in the middle now. Clary Connors well represented in this. John Hawkes has got a couple in it, starter came off his ladder. Goes back to the second rung presses the button and there they go a great start it was two in the flight stakes and Ginzano in Seattle Jim got the best of it moving up quickly on the inside and gathering ground is Sam followed closely by Port View and I Solder then a break to tripping and further back warning Bell and hit eponymous shame is out off the course from Kirov dancer then Pontal Lass length and a half to nightclub two lengths Rose and Thorpe and last is show of force heading along past the 1200 meters plenty of speed on to Ginzano just the leader now from Seattle Gem. I sold a third and wide out tripping. Some on the inside from Hedipotamus. And behind those warning, Bell and Port View, a length and a half to Kirov Dancer, who's parked on the inside of Shame and then Pontal Lass and Nightclub. Good margin away next on the inside rail being at this stage second last Rosenthorpe and Shoal Force brings up the rear. 700 left to go. And Seattle Gem on the inside is the leader from Ginzano tripping third from Sam. And then I sold it from warning Bell a length to Shame and a length and a half to Port View and then Hedipotamus Nightclub. Pontel Lass rather awkwardly placed from Shoal Force making ground on the extreme outside from Kirov Dancer and Absolute as the despised Ruffy Rosenthorpe. They straighten up in the flight stakes and Seattle Jim the leader from Ginzano tripping in third spot. Shame is next followed by some. Pontel Lass is weaving a run. Here she comes through on the inside. Shoal Force the outside. Tripping hits the front. Pontel Lass out after her very quickly from Shame and Shoal Force but Pontel Pontel Lass from near the tail. Oh, what a ride this. Pontel Lass coming away now from Tripping and Shame. And Pontel Lass wins the flight stakes from Tripping and Shame. Then Kirov Dancer followed by Nightclub I Solder, Shoal Force, Rosenthorpe, Hippopotamus, Warning Bell, Seattle Gem, and then Portview Sam. And Ginzano knocked up and finished at the tail of the field. Number three, Pontel Lass to return 460 and 180. Number 10, Tripping to return $4. And number four, Shame, two even. Smanship, $4.10 and $1.80. Awkwardly positioned 700 to go, but he weaved clear and he saw that there was a gap on the inside. And this marauding filly did uh, what was required and she scored at 410 and 180. Number 10, Tripping, ridden by Mick Ditton, second. So Clary Connors has... Um, Quinellid, the flight stakes, number 10, tripping second at $3.80, Mick Dittman. And at number four, Shame, third, written by Darren Gauchy, has paid $2.30. It's 3.10.4 officially on the flight stakes, and the winner by Marauding from Pier is trained by Clary Connors for the New Haven Park Stud Limited Syndicate in Curtis and HN. The runner-up... Tripping by Marauding from Lady Blanford, Clary Connors, Mick Detman on Shame by Sanic from Shamail, John Hawkes, Darren Gauchy. Fourth went to number one, I Solder. Number one, officially fourth in a photo. And 11, Kirov Dancer was fifth. The run, 136.55. 136.55, thanks. Tone sectionally coming to hand, 36.49. 36.49. And they went 48-1 for the first 800 metres. She's a very, very good filly. And... Uh, She'll certainly acquit herself well when Clary takes her south for the big events coming up during the spring. Now, Rodney, we've got a little bit of a time gap between... Uh